Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play The Witcher 3 with me, Varax, Geralt and Roach, who was over there, 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 there she is. <clears throat> As we continue to head south, to track down the thieves of the old fort, uh, Roach, 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 steady on, steady on. So we're going to have a nice little meander in that direction, see if we can find anything along the way, which is likely, I guess. During the game, it's jump packed full of stuff and things. But I'm not particularly going to be using the map so much. Just, uh, just, just, just letting uh, self be guided by the terrain. So that's where we just were, right? I believe it is. There can't be two giant freaking ruined keeps around here, surely. Yep, yeah, this is it. Okay. That was good. And, uh... What a nice waterfall there. Want to just, just visit that, maybe? It's weird, because this, uh... River seems to be flowing away from the... Slower. The sea. So I thought the sea's, like, over that way. Should we just have a little look? I know I said I wouldn't check the map, but... Um... Yeah, it's flowing... This way, well, down here, which is, and the just there. So it's not, it's not impossible. It's just, just it's strange for me to see. Hello, everyone. Only me, just passing through. I noticed you have a merchant, so I might just stop there. I do. Greetings. You're in luck. Yesterday, Alf wrapped us as long ship sailed into port, so we've got fresh goods for you. How about some? No, we'll, we'll do that first, because otherwise I'll forget. Let me see what Hotspur brought in. I'm sure we've got some stuff to get rid of, haven't we? Oh, but we've already used this guy. All right, well, we can. Uh, just do some cards then, because I don't believe... Oh, wait, no, it has It has been uh, grayed out, so... So long. Never mind. Well, I'll just move on from you then. Oh, what the hell? It's been like three seconds. Mm. And you instantly go and steal Hard someone's... Skin. Someone's... Apples or sweet rolls or something. Bad. Bad horsey. Come on, Roach. Right, yes. We'll just we'll just wander into the uh well we'll stay on the path maybe. Yeah, why not? Because the path is where all the good views are apparently. Beautiful. Getting lost again. So serene and nice, and now of course the path is completely ended. It seems. Well, at least as far as the minimap is, but I'm, but it's it's here. So I like That's that. It, how it's sort of been overgrown and. Um, all right, we'll go south. I don't know where south is. Uh, and not really marked as a path anymore, even though it's kind of still here. Like completely disused, probably from the lesson, right? Not, uh, not, not letting people through. I'm gonna try and cut across here. Yep, this is indeed a path, even though it isn't. Oh, there's something up there. Whoa! Yeah, whoa. Okay, what's this then? You marker, just entrance. Okay. Let's have a little look, shall we? Hmm. Intriguing. Actually, a little easy to see without the light. Nothing's here, which makes me think something may be here later. Yeah. If, um... If we come back. Request. But we don't have yet. It's possible, but for now there is free loot, so... You know, I'll just say no.
Oh, this is just a okay. What have you found, girl? Oh, okay. All right. Well, that's easy enough. Hopefully, right? What are you doing? All right. <laughs> okay, we found something. <laughs> Dearest Sir Robert de Mare, thank you for sending a bill of exchange and advice in advance and for your understanding. If I give out advice for free, I'll quickly run myself out of business. You wrote that your son went missing while on a voyage and that near the place where he was last seen, there now lurks a necker who wears a tattered shirt with your son's monogram sword on it. You asked if this is possible this Necker was your son, transformed by some spell. After consulting the relevant literature, it pains me to inform you that your hypothesis is highly improbable and there exists, a much sim much, there exists a much simpler and more likely explanation. Contrary to popular belief, Neckers are a uh, sapient species. Like forest trolls, they will at times decorate themselves with pigments or scraps and human garments. One can, with some confidence, surmise this Necker killed your son, tore up his shirt, then donned it for some fragment thereof. Awesome, awesome fragment thereof. While that is likely the case, one cannot be certain. Though I have not heard of any ca a curse capable of turning a man into a Necker, I cannot rule out the possibility of his existence. In order to find out if the above-mentioned Necker truly is a creature born of a curse, the tattered shirt it wears must be taken from it, cut into shreds and burned. The shirt's asses can then be mixed with... Uh, the meritorium dust um, if the resulting substance changes colour it will confirm your hypothesis if the experiment I described uh, returns positive result please write me I would gladly undertake further examinations meant to find a way to lift the curse for additional payment of course oh <laughs> well looks like I just killed the necker so um, whoops although you couldn't learn about that you know until after you killed the necker That Necker wasn't wearing a shirt anyway, unless I just picked it up, but... So did we pick up a quest there? I don't think so. <clears throat> so check where that is. Okay, that's over there. I thought it was, that was, I thought it was on this island. But nowhere near us. A bloody trail, but I think we found it backwards. Ow. Cheeky kids. Oh, hey, Geralt, don't put your freaking sword away. <laughs> Come on, Geralt, it was your fault. It's right there, you can see it, and you're like, no, it's fine, it's fine. Hmm. Now you can put the sword away, even though I'm seeing two enemies. Alright, so we've obviously broke into somewhere fairly substantial. Dear sir, you were kind enough to share with me your doubts concerning the contract. You made it clear you believe it impossible for a man to turn into a necker. You even drove uh, the point home with humorous comparisons, saying, I believe, same as a pig wouldn't turn into a horse, or even if you strap a saddle on it and call it Black Beauty. Entirely possible that you are right, but if there exists even the shadow of a chance that my son has been imprisoned in the body of that monster, that some spell or curse has done this to him, I will not rest until I try every possible way of helping him. That is why I would ask you to refrain from further attempts at humour and uh, keep your doubts to yourself. Instead, channel those energies towards doing the job for which you shall be paid. Catch the Necker, 
and collect your gold. The rest um, shouldn't interest you. From Robert Demare. So this is not Robert Demare. This is the person who um, he hired. So they were keeping Neckers in here. They've all obviously just escaped. Right. Okay. So we're gonna piece this back from like backwards, if you like, because we found the. Um, On it the wrong way around and then you go through here and, and kill these and loot them all and yada 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 and then you go up there and you find the other necker which we killed by stabbing it in the back hmm There's definitely some quests going on here that we've we've found backwards. <clears throat> Though that 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 entrance isn't really subtle. I mean, it is marked on the map with a grippy girl sort of brown splotch. So, what's it gonna do? Oh yeah, it's. What if we just found that? Uh, one for selling, I think. All right. Found a monster den. Just up here. I wonder where we are now. Oh, we've just come out the monster den. There's a flyy thing over there, right? I don't know where we are now, obviously. Why would I know where I am? Some sort of professional monster hunter might, but I don't. Oh, hello. Hello down there. Hmm. Alright, so if that's a monster den, maybe there's a way to blow it up if we can find it. Or maybe it just, like, literally is just a, this entrance to the monster den, but... Well, what's this? Just a save, shall we? Hello? Okay, just trying to get the best weapon in the game out. There we go. Fighting it in this terrain is going to be really annoying because I can't roll too much. It has given up its um, advantage, its winged advantage, uh, you know, flying advantage thing. Just instantly lose my shield, but I did a lot of damage to it. bad was it the shield did most of it actually just take a cockatrice's cr stomach just, just take it so anything around here because they're usually circling something they're guarding than I could see and I don't want to go too far away because I'm going to forget that um is it a place of power? No. Maybe this? No? Yeah there's some there's some there's something in this lake I want to grab. Definitely not these that it was guarding. I think I know where I am from the terrain because it all forms into this sort of wide delta that then um, goes into the sea. I 
I yeah, don't know what it was guarding, if anything. <clears throat> Alright, yeah, that was... Time for a bit of a dip, right? Yeah, Nick is over there as well. Well, they're there. Let's kill them. The rude not to sort of half be expecting it. A lot of them. What should we do? Hmm. Perhaps I can beat you. Yeah, we'll do. Well, we'll do this first. Back. The, the trap was really useful. I cast it by accident, but went with it and it worked. <clears throat> Fine. Oh, hello. Yeah, because that one's wearing like a cow skull or something. So he killed a cow and said, like, I'm going to wear your skull, so... The other one was entirely likely to have just killed this dude and worn his shirt. That was a bit eager, wasn't it? Mind you, they all have. But hey. They've all killed cows. Maybe it's some sort of rite of passage in their tribe. Now, it's not to be mocked, cows are a large animal, but while quite docile, if you rile it up, I imagine it could be quite dangerous. It's got horns, so if they were killing bulls, that's even more impressive. Yeah, it looks like, a, like an ox. Oh. What now? Just have a chicken sandwich, Carol. Just chill out. Ow. Yeah, stay down. Not you. Okay, fine. Okay, so back on track. I know it's not going in the wrong direction. I know, but I know that I'm supposed to be over that way. I'm not supposed to go this way. That's north, right? Yeah, so why would I need to go that way? Is this, is this way? Okay, so I just have to get over this mountain. <laughs> right. Hmm. Okay, I, can't, I can't tell which way. I wasn't looking at the compass. I was trying to tell which way this was flowing, and I instantly thought it was flowing that way, which I thought was south. But it seems to be flowing that way. It's weird because the mountains are in this direction, so you'd think that would be the higher land. But I guess it's just like going through the valley between the mountains, obviously, but. Boom! That was just run off. I like it. No, no, Garrett, we're not done yet. No, Carol, Carol. Such a hassle for you to uh, keep your sword out. Stop doing your twirly. Just whack the freaking monster with your twirly attacks. There, now you can put the sword away. Okay, now we're on a path again, and uh, somehow, some way, you've made it over the mountain. I don't know how. I don't know how, but you, you have. Come on. Congratulations. Well done. And I guess we're a bit closer to uh, where we we're supposed to be. We, we cut across the valley. Whether that was beneficial or not, I'm not really sure. We merge. Oh, look at that. Ah, that's brilliant. 
Yeah, yeah, I'm liking that. It's, that's just great. This is great, like sort of like. I don't know if it's world building or or just map design, but yeah, well done with that. Okay, I think we're actually getting pretty close because it is a hill fort, isn't it? And these are. I mean, it's yeah, we found it. We found Snow it. This now. is, it. This is totally it. Right, we found it. We're going to use our. Um, we're going to influence someone's mind. I think. Once we get in, we're just going to climb over the wall. Right? No? Would that be too. Too ambitious to just climb over the wall? Fine. Fine. Yeah. We'll climb over the wall. How about here? Oh, hang on. Yeah, okay. So there are some dudes in there. I think this way is the best way to go. A monster nest. Okay, maybe. All right, so it looks like they've got here and then maybe been um, just killed by monsters. Okay, we got a quest update. Kill the thieves. So there's a monster nest and thieves in there? What the hell's the way in now? What the hell? Like, kill the thieves. I'm like, well, I would. I could get into the bloody fort. I didn't think the entrance would be down here, and it isn't. So, where is it? Oh, okay, it is. I was wrong. Alright, I am hearing, um. Alright, we got, we got the drop on him. Hanged Man's Venom, where are you? And we'll, uh... Poison? Okay, that's good. Um, lines? Yeah. Freezes? Gas? Ooh. I just... Love a grenade in there, I think. Hi, guys. Oh, that didn't really work that well, did it? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Okay, we won. <laughs> Alright, yeah, yeah, that was that, that worked. But a monster den as well, huh? They should have had someone watching the um watching the entrance, shouldn't they? A journal, huh? We've sold it to someone else. <laughs> uh Sphina, <laughs> got good news and bad. I'll start with the bad. Me and Grimry went to Lugos, gave us the welcome custom demands, mead and meat plenty. But as soon as we unwrapped Julio from its leather and asked him how much we could give us for it, he ripped the blade from our hands and knocked us both on our asses, calling us thieves. Then he sent us running from his house, hounds at our heels. Grimir, uh, Gimri runs slow, so they got him. That's fine. Only means a big go for us. Now here's the good news. Still got the sword. And I know how to get rid of it. I talked to Dean Finn, my brother-in-law, and he'll sell Julio in Novigrad. <laughs> and split. They're going for us after. Brilliant. I know, I know, but I swear you can trust him. I'll give him the sword on the beach by, uh, by the whale cemetery in Ard Skellig. But go alone, it's not attract attention. Watch out. Uh, Lugos might have sent a message to Kia Trolled it, uh, to inform them of the theft, just in case. Hold up somewhere, maybe with Aunt Hildy? Ooh. She's not right in the head, but you can rely on her anyway. Well, Hildy was the um, woman who we almost drove out of that, that village because she was, like, possessed by the Leshen. Right? This is a different Hildy. 
Ah, uh, for God's sakes, now I gotta go wheel great. What the f <laughs> Alright, fine. Fine. I I see. I find. Fine. Uh let's just loot the rest of them. You guys just like just like a bit headed horse there that's half dismembered. You're like, yeah, it's a good place to keep camp. Harpies got their nest here. Destroy it! But do not look at the explosion, Carol. Don't even flinch like it. This place has seen better days. <laughs> was reasonably grand at one point but not anymore right so before we even like think about looking for the thieves near the whale graveyard uh, oh where the hell are you we'll continue the main quest um not right now but the main quest is like it's like here right and we've got all these little bits and bobs around there but i think the sensible thing of course is to head straight into wherever this is um and see what's happening get some areas of interest and check those out and let's just have a little look actually about where we've just been so we found this because we were heading the yeah, along here weren't we so we were sort of like going this way but we ended up okay we ended up coming down here to there and so we're in this kind of lake area. I thought we were over here. Which is why I thought that it would be flowing this way towards the sea. But it wasn't flowing anywhere. Because it was well, it's a lake. It's a low-lying lake. Uh, and then we found this. Yeah, and that was really good. How that rise opens up into this, this, this plane here. This bay. Brilliant. Alright, so we'll head in the direction that I'm facing. There's a town right there. Makes things easy. Literally see it. Not even I can get lost, right? What's over here? Yeah, I'm hoping that this, this noise board it'll it'll put out a bunch of uh I don't know, there's a shipwreck over there and oh my god. Just stuffing things everywhere. We'll mosey on into town and um see what these we'll see what's going on. Take it easy. All right, you just uh, enjoy that. Some guy fishing over there. I like that. Okay, we've got an armor here. Um, in this building. How are things? Business good? Why wouldn't it be? Seeing as I make the best arms in the Isles. Just look. Iron ore from the bowels of Mount Ardfond, where giants once tore up the earth. Then my forge fire, blazing unbroken for six generations, its care passed from father to son. And every day come dawn, Hara, my youngest, she pricks her finger and squeezes a drop of her blood into the water I use to temper the blades. Hmm. Let's see what's going on. Anything new in Fearstar? No, <laughs> nothing. Good. This ain't the continent. Fashions don't change with the melting snows. We live like our fathers and grandfathers lived. Fishing, hunting, and raiding. And so shall we live. To Ragnarok and beyond. Alright, um, let's see what he's got. Hmm, let me have a look. So I doubt he's got anything here that's any good, but we do have, like, all this to sell, so... He's got a lot of money. Get rid of the armor as well, because it's... Heavy. Alright, and we've got a load of silver swords that we're just, like, keeping for... Not really a lot of reason. I don't worry. Okay, so we've got, we've got the stunning one. The freezing one. And the uh, stagger... Yeah, we'll get rid of this one. Yeah, forgot about that. Um, I 
Why doesn't you really you don't really do a lot for me, can you? You can make some crisp bubbles. Oh my god. Oh. Should I? No, I'll never use them. Of course we're gonna play Gwent. Yearning to play a few rounds of Gwent. That ought to set me straight. Absolutely. We're not going to be monsters, that would be a terrible idea. Alright, I don't have any other leaders for these guys. It's interesting, but... Ah, oh, the Skyatel! I freaking hate Skyatel! God damn, I hate them. Uh, close combat's probably not going to help me too much, so I might get rid of that. Um... Okay, a lot of specials. I'm gonna get rid of the biting. Well, actually, no, because they, they do tend to spam that a little bit. The commander's horn's not that useful. Neither Siegfried. So we'll get rid of that. Maybe I'll get, I'll get rid of you. Get rid of you. Don't you? Okay, we got him. Um. Yeah. So this isn't going to be any good for us. Neither is that. Yeah. The, yeah. The, the the biting frost could work for for this kind of thing. Um. I don't know. I don't. I, I don't really have a very good hand here. I don't think. Well, this, this one out. Yeah, keep doing that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's good. Fine. Cement my um, advantage here. early for this maybe? I don't know. <laughs> do, I, do I like him? Okay. I mean he's wasting all these cards by doing that. Right, horn, horn these. Hell yeah, with. I'm hoping that'll kind of do, right? Maybe not. <laughs> hey, it's going to tell. I hate them. I do get a card back if I win the round, but we're like using everything here, man. Oh, you what? You... Ugh. Okay, fine. Fine. I can get I can get a card back with uh, her. Don't have anything left now. Come on. Okay, right. I will pass as well. <laughs> no, I'm passing. I'm passing. I'm, I'm good for that. So I'll get a card as well. Okay, that's rubbish. <laughs> okay, well... Oh man, I, he hasn't played any spies or anything. Oh, I could have, maybe I could have used that last time. Never thought of that. All right, so yeah, it's, yeah, yeah, deadline's useless. That's, that's as good as we're going to get. Yeah, thanks. A front line is down the line. What's he got left? A six. Okay, and... Uh, we got nothing. Come on. Come on. Come on. Don't have anything. Don't have anything. Oh, brilliant. Oh, okay. I fucking hate playing Scoyotel. I, I hate... I hate them. They had, they had, they had like... Very few good cards. Yeah, that's Cirilla and Yarvith, and that was about it. And yet, still... Oh, God, I hate it. I mean, what, what do we get? Ten crowns, obviously. Impenetrable Fog. Thanks! Thanks for that. Thanks. That was worse. That stress. Alright, we're gonna emerge in as well. A roaring gale! A roaring gale? Really? See you come from afar. 
Ought to replenish your supplies, I wager. Yes. Well, I've maybe. Uh, what are you offering? Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. So last last time I got some comments about combining these. Uh, good idea. I will. Um, get rid of that. But the issue is, um, you know, the reason that I'm not very good at, at, at applying comments is that I read them the day that, that they're posted, which is usually the day that the upload goes goes live. And I'm like, oh yeah, I'll do that. But then it's like three days later that I record the next episode and, and usually it's just like, right, I'm going to record The Witcher. And then I realise, oh, hang on a minute, yeah, someone said something last time. So, and that makes me feel, um, feel bad, honestly, but not bad enough to change the way that's what we're doing it, you know. But I will reread that. But I don't think I can do it here anyway. Get some cards in too. I'll be Good idea, though. Man. Don't be Skellige. Sorry, don't be, don't be, oh, you want this, okay, yeah, don't be, um, and score yourself, that's it. Okay, two horns, huh? Well, okay, all right, there's some potential here. I don't think I need two, though, I don't think I need dandelion. Okay. So one horn for these, one horn for them. We can put in the back. We can, we can work with this. You know, it might have a spy or something. Yeah, why not? don't play monsters that often, so it'll be kind of interesting to see what they do. <laughs> oh, yeah. unfortunate, but it'd be worse, because they, they could have doubled each other up then. Fine. you and the witcher too <laughs> click hire and simple take your best sword and sell it and hire a witcher <laughs> In this, you know, I don't think it's going to go well. I didn't get a great hand with like no specials, bloody hell. Then he's got, he's got, he's got no cards. So if we just screw it, right? If I just um, get, if we get him back, I have the, the the potential of doubling him. But I'd rather just get back, and then we'll 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 just cut our losses. Yeah, you're going to pass. I'm going to pass. So I got five cards, he's got two. And these are all like have value, so um What does the monster think though? No. Okay, alright, so it's, that one stays on the board, which is lucky because it's the best one he had. He's gonna decoy it. But uh, that okay, well at least Alright, that makes sense. So now I know what one of his cards are. That's nice. Okay. Yep, that's fine. I reckon we got this. I don't think he can outstrength us, really. Uh, we'll go on Siegfried. Oh, man. Hang on. Oh, you what? I think we still do it. Yeah, so they have a lot of cards that draw from their deck as well, from their, yeah, their deck rather than their hand. But yeah, we got this. Hmm. 
not as easy as I would have wanted, but we got there. Ten crowns. Oh, that looks like a uh, Goya Cell one. Yeah, there we go. One. Brilliant. <laughs> that's the worst. Awesome. Yeah, yeah, that, that's that's good. Um, all right. Where's the nice pod? Get up into town. Oh. Oh. A monster. Teeth like, well, this oh. my is shreds. What to me? All right. Hey, a witcher. Freya be praised. Hello. Witcher, help. And then what? Then nothing. Never you mind. This here's a job for a witcher. As you wish. What's the problem? A beast. It attacked me. Me and my comrade. We'll gut the fucker. Aye, but not us. The Witcher. Why bother the witch man? Like as not it were a pack of wolves. But they got you so afeard you shat yourself and sore specters. Let me round up a few sturdy lads and we'll... <laughs> Won't be needed. The Witcher will help, right? You shan't let us down. Feral folk, dumb as stumps. You from Pharaoh? Come a long way. That just happened. Came to Fairsdal to trade a load of hides from Svorlag. Svorlag? Thought you were from Pharaoh. Svorlag's on Speakerog. Uh, ah, well, you see, first I sailed from Pharaoh to Svorlag. Traded some loot from the continent for hides there, then came here. Pharaoh to Speakerog to Ard Skellig. Huh. Roundabout journey. I hadn't much choice, had I? A merchant sails where the trade's good, not where it's close at hand. Right. That hunter, could he be right? Maybe it was just wolves. I knows what I saw. Besides, who's he to say? Those drum and blaggards don't know shite from shoelaces. That particular blaggard was wearing on crate colors. Uh, you sure about that? Sure, then sure. Ugh, doesn't matter. That lot's not to be trusted either. Monsters attacked me. I need a witcher, not some hunter. This is definitely not a normal monster hunt thing. This guy's up to something. Fine. What's this about? <laughs> Tell me. Excuse me. Me and my mate were on our way here to Fearsdal with a cart full of hides. Suddenly we heard a screech. Our horse got spooked, started kicking, and then monsters jumped out of the bushes. My mate drew the short straw. They got him first. By some miracle, I managed to get away. What kind of monsters? Nekuks. No doubt about it. What? <laughs> you know, sharp claws, animal skulls on their heads, attacking swarms. Neckers? Yeah, neckers. Near 20 of them. That's, so that's... will you help? Of, you know, you the bastards? they are around here, so that road needs to be clear. Aim to travel it again soon. Totally a trap, but yeah, huh, don't know. You lost your transport, so I don't see how you're going to pay me, and I don't work for free. I've coins set aside, I'm sure we'll agree terms. How much would you ask? <laughs> this is a lot of money for killing some neckers, right? A fair price, nice. So how will it be? So he has no intention of paying me anyway. I'll help you. Grand! Knew a witcher wouldn't let me down. Not like some waffly prick from Clan Drumdund. Or Clan Drummond. <laughs> Good luck, witcher. <laughs> Fare you well. Okay. Wait. Where should I look for you? What? Once I finish, where will I find you? Oh, oh I, I, um, here. I Meaning in the tavern nearby. I'll await you there. Fine. See ya. I'm only curious about why he would be. Uh, oh, look at this! It's a 
red skull thing. Right. Now, I'm only curious about... Because if it's like a pre-planned ambush... No, I'm not going to mind control the cat. Everyone will hate me. Um, why would he be then talking to the guards first? I'll leave that cat alone. Doesn't seem to like me. Um... Uh, what level is it? 29? Seems a bit much, really. Let's see what's on this notice board. Which is in the way. Or on the way. Uh, beware of wolves. Quite a few wolf packs about this year in our Skellig. Guard your sheep like your daughter's honour and travel after... Dark, only on swift steed with your sword at your side. Will do. Uh, to all women skilled in weaving and embroidery, come to Hefred's house. Where every evening we'll weave a tapestry showing the history of our clan. Shall be hung in the common hall. Well, okay. Um, I'll think about that. Yesterday, young Scott Guard shot a doe from 100 feet away with such force that the arrow buried into the doe's brisket up to the fletching and killed her on the spot. For this extraordinary achievement, the council of elders have decided to bestow upon him the name Red Arrow. Could be a lot worse. Got a lot of uh, <laughs> nicknames worse than that. Attention, some reminders for men who will um, join a raid for the first time this spring. Abandon your shield and you'll be clobbered to death with it. Okay. Desert the battlefield and you'll be... Uh, and uh, Stone will be hung around your neck and you'll be drowned in open sea. Okay. Fail to slay at least one foe in the raid and you'll have to shave off your beard and moustache when you return. Right. Okay. Thanking the gods. My son cannot re uh, return from a, a raid, though everyone said he died a hero's death in Nilfgaard. I prayed day and night for him and my prayers got answered. He returned. Thank the gods. I will need to eat or drink for two weeks. And a dragon, huh? Uh, listen careful, folks. A dragon, to top all dragons, the terror straight from the scarred tails has infested the lands of Fierce Style. 50 foot long, 100 foot tall, and can incinerate a man with fire from 100 spans off, or maybe even more. It's hard to say exactly, for no man's been anywhere near that close to the creature and escaped with his life. Yet I faith, there is a son of Skelliger brave enough to defend us from this evil by slaying the dragon. In exchange, he'll get more than just a reward. He'll have the right to take the gold, which, as Aerofield the knows, these foul beast guards in their lair. Right. A dragon. Okay, let's check this out. So let's get all this more att uh, attention a little bit more. Sure. Hear about the dragon, I reckon. Tell me about this dragon. <laughs> What's it look like, for instance? You don't know. What kind of monster slayer are ye? It's got scales, wings, claws. A dragon's a dragon. You point Gavin. Just go kill it. For it makes more corpses. Uh, we don't kill dragons. Which is don't Let's kill dragons. Let's talk about the reward. See what you're offering for this dragon. Usually get that much for a necker. You see, yeah. Um, well, apart from the, uh, uh, sometimes they do. Anyway, um, yeah, three hundred thirty-one. It's a lot, but then a dragon's a lot. Too. Right, so they got more. Exit. Okay, a dragon, huh? Witches don't usually kill dragons, mm. but I'll look into it. You said something about victims, right? Two brothers, Askel and Nilus, went out to hunt, turned into prey. Wounds, so horrible. Even I went weak in the knees when they brought them in. And I've seen my share of bloody harm. Been on 32 raids, from Povus to the mountains of... Fascinating story, I'm sure. But I'm more interested in these wounds. Can you describe them? Look for yourself. Family's only now preparing the boy's funeral. Their corpses still lie in their home, at the village's northern end. But treat the bodies with respect, mind ye. As tradition demands... Go on, poke and prod. No? Hi. 
well, well. Another come to gawk at the dragon's victims. Perhaps I should start charging for the pleasure. Perhaps. I wouldn't pay you, though. See enough corpses in my line of work. I'm a witcher. Here because I took the contract for that dragon of yours. Oh, f forgive me. I, I didn't know. How, how can I help? Where were the bodies found? In the glade past the river. The lads, they liked that place since they were tykes. They'd go there to catch hares. Might not be easy for you, but I have to look at their injuries. At least you asked me permission, not like the others. If it'll help you kill the beast, fine. Do as you will. That's everything for now. Thanks for your help. And I promise to avenge them. Do you, girl? Do you? I don't know whether that's very wise. Claw marks, bite marks, but no fire damage. Interesting. No feet either. I'm not going to... Think about that. Bit of dismemberment going on. Oh, okay. Right, that was it. Hmm? Hmm. It's like a old siege tower or something there. What are we doing out here, though? Probably isn't. Also, now that we've looked at that, do we have the points of interest? A couple, yeah. Okay. There's something there, isn't there? Let's go. Well, I didn't take long. So, what are we finding, Geralt? What's about... What do, what do you see? Dead cow? Pretty weak dragon. Couldn't lift a cow. <laughs> Just tore it up and left it here. It's a little dragon, alright? Don't... Don't shame the dragon. Cow's blood. Might lead me to the lair. Maybe. It is an old siege tower or something, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Bone shattered. Fell from high up. In the tower, yeah. A nest. A fork tails looks like. But it's empty. No point waiting. Gotta rustle up some bait. The dragon. I will go and see the mayor. I just wanna... I wonder what the hell this thing's doing here. I love how it's... still here. Like, it's obviously been here for a long time. Where the hell were they going with it? Ooh, hello, what's that? What is that? Oh, there's a big castle thing. Big castle thing. Big, big castle thing. Oh, yeah. Okay, all right. Okay, they, so they, they, they just built it too far away, I reckon. They couldn't get it there, so they left it. Oh, that's great. That's great. I love it. I love it. I love it. And there's like, the fiery thing up there. Oh, my God. I gotta go and see everything. But yeah, I really like that. How that's there and it's fallen into this ditch. Oops. And they just left it and it's just been left ever since and it's all got overgrown and now it's part of the part of the landscape and it's, it's, yeah, it's good. It's good I like it. Alright, so let's bring you back into town. So I know I will be needing you. And somewhere cozy to put you. I tell you, why, why not here, right? I mean, it's not particularly cozy, but there's some hay, and I'm sure this guy's a nice, nice bloke, right? Nothing here for you. 
Yeah, but for the horse there is, so that's fine. Oh, raining again. Yeah, I know, I know. I know. Maybe we needed a spot around. So will you help with the dragon, or not? Found your dragon's nest. <laughs> but I'll need bait to kill it. A sheep, for instance. Ah, I see. You gonna stuff it with sulfur? <sighs> Another ally of the brave little shoemaker. Now I'll manage without sulfur. Just need a sheep, unseasoned. <laughs> Fine. There's one I can give you. It's a bit mangy, but it'll do. Know how to get a sheep to move where you want? I gotta drive it like a sheep dog. Go at it from the left, it'll go right. Go at it from the right, it'll go. If dogs have figured it out, think I'll manage as well. Oh, I don't have to. Okay, cutscene. Good. <laughs> Couldn't imagine that made a bit of busy work. How do you call a sheep? Here, sheepy, sheepy. Hey, sheep, come here. We got us a fork tail to hunt. Okay, we do have to try. Oh, for God's sakes, really. Giddy up, sheep. Move along. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep talking. Okay, I'll keep talking. Okay, we do have to do this. So, man. okay. I hope the sheep survives. Poor, poor Mia. Well, this is going well. Hey, go on. Go on. Hey, feather. There you go. I'm sure you'll be fine, lady. I'm just gonna save it. I'm sure the sheep. Will be... I want to save the sheep. <laughs> yeah, man. Finally. Okay. Run away, sheep. Run away. No. Oh, damn it. Oh. The drag. Oh, hang on. That's the wrong button. Where's me? There it is, see? Critical hit. Best weapon in the game. Just, just a second. Oh, God. I've started this very well, have I? Alright, get this. There. Okay, good. Then we need, um, fucking, like, some healing. Okay, good. Then we need to hit the beast we're fighting. Yeah, that's what we need to do. Get the shield again. Die, 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 Oh god, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Best weapon in the game. Here we go. See? Sandwich. Let's swap in the game. Come on. I'll stay in the. Oh god. Maybe we should use an oil. Right, I'm gonna finish it off with that. Oh yeah, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, <laughs> it's not gonna have it, is it? Come on, kill it with the crossbow. <laughs> God thanks. That it? Critical damage twenty six. Like I said, best weapon in the game. Hey, see, told you. Told you, best weapon in the game. 
You okay. died for a good cause, sheep. Rest in peace. Aww. All right, I got another trophy. I want to save the sheep. I feel bad. Even though I just having like chicken sandwiches and stuff all the time. No. Um, what's gonna do? Inventory, there we go. Um we got Dancer, which is not that good. Um Clever though, can't get it up there. I like he, how he acknowledged the, th the, the, the sheep sacrifice though. And there's a bit of humor in there. Good little quest there. Friends we show heart, foes we show heart. Uh, the dragon's dead. So will you help with the dragon, or not? Solved your problem. And? That it? Tell me more. Did the dragon breathe fire, spit venom? That was no dragon. It was a forked tail. Looks similar, but it's smaller. Less dangerous. Less dangerous, you say? But your reward ought to be less as well. Uh -huh. Listen, we agreed to a specific sum. Aye, for a dragon. If I'd known it was some forky tail, I'd have killed it myself. That's that. Ooh, well, I got a level up, at least. There's a monster. Up comes a witcher. The monster's gone. How much did I get paid then? I mean, the money doesn't matter too much. 165. I should have said it had golden scales. Mind you, he'd probably be like, oh, well, you don't need paying then since he's got a golden scales. So he might have just been one of those, right? Anyway, um, we're done with this place now. So, we got one of these first time in a while. I did start getting. Let's see. So it's fine, it's fine. Let's find yeah. okay, let's see. So generally the hit point loss thing damage lowered by. I'm not really using adrenaline that much. Could go for more of that. Active human attaining it, blocking it, um, blocking attacks during stamina, damage absorbed by the shield restores vitality. Ooh, so like a healing shield. That seems pretty good. Yeah, maybe. That's something to think about. So I could go for something like this to go alongside that when we unlock that. Um, or I can I can obviously do this. Uh, <laughs> um, I could do a strong attack, weak attack, but I think a lot of people do that, and I kind of want to branch out a little bit, so I might go for like... Hmm... Yeah, so this just makes the traps I, I do better, so I think I will do this. I'll get the, um... Hit that. But... Let's 
how, how to fit it on here. I guess I don't need puppet that much, do I? So even though I, I invested quite heavily in it, I haven't used it that much. It's kind of hard to use in combat because um, you kind of like it takes a while to do, and you're this enemies charging at you or shoot, you know, arrows at you, and so yeah, I think I'll put the one on the back burner. So we'll put that there. Um, okay. Right, I'm probably gonna, gonna uh, call it there. Next time we'll head up here. I might look at this one there. Um, oh man, there's some, of oh course, you know. well, we don't, I'll tell you what we'll do, we'll, we'll probably head this way, right? We'll probably go down here, check all this out, because we're here. So, um, that's probably what we'll do, quite honestly. Um, get a boat, and then go here, and there, and then round there, and then head back, and then see what happens. That's probably what we'll do, frankly, something like that. But I guess I'll decide at the time. All right, well, thank you, everybody, for watching. I hope you enjoyed that one, and I will see you next time. Till then, cheers very much. Take care. Good luck. Uncle said, poke on the con